What's up crew, welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for tuning into today's episode. I have an awesome video in store for you today. We are gonna be reviewing and styling our hair with the Monarch Matte Paste by Blumon. Let's get started. Today we are going to be styling our hair with the Blumon Monarch Matte Paste. I'm super stoked to try this product because I have never tried Blumon products before. So I'm really curious to see how it's going to work in my hair as well as if it's a halfway decent matte paste product because most of the time matte products don't have great hold or they just look too matte and it makes your hair look damaged. So I'm curious to see how this is going to work. Now before I style my hair, I have shampooed and conditioned it. It's pretty much you know, almost dry now, but there's still a little bit of dampness on the top, which is what you want when applying hair products to your hair. And I'm actually not gonna use this product as the baseline for my hairstyle. When Joe from Blue Mon styles his hair with this product, he always uses it as a post styler. Now that's not to say that you can't use it as a pre styler and a post styler, I'm sure you could do both but it is designed to be used as a post styling hair product. And the reason for that, that I've discovered after you know using it for about a week or so, is that if I use it as a pre-styling hair product, it sort of diffuses when I put heat on it. Meaning when I use the hair dryer, it gets very, very soft. Almost too soft. It doesn't feel like my hair has a ton of hold. It has the volume and it has like a nice feel when you run your hands through your hair because it's soft, but it doesn't feel like it's gonna hold up in the heat. So that's why Blumon himself probably uses a pre-styler like the original by Blumon before using this product. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm not gonna be using original, but I'm gonna be using a very generic hair product and I'm gonna use the Paul Mitchell Reformer as a pre-styler. Now the reason I chose the Paul Mitchell Reformer is because I have found this to be a very good pre-styling product. It's not too thick, it's not too thin, it doesn't leave a bunch of residue in your hair, it's just nice volumizing and it has a nice smell to it. So I'm only gonna get a little bit of this stuff about that much, not too much at all about the size of a dime, just to set my hair in place. Another reason I wanted to use the Reformer is because it has texturizing qualities and it has fibrous qualities, meaning that it's going to give my hair a lot of flexible hold and a lot of flexible volume, which is very similar to the original by Blumon from what I've seen and from what I've heard. All right, now that I've got that all the way in my hair, I'm going to use a hair dryer. Keep in mind, I did not use a ton of the Paul Mitchell Reformer because I want to save room for the Monarch Matte to do its job. So just a little bit, just enough to give my hair some volume and hold pre-styling. Now let's hit it with some heat. see now I have tons of volume in my hair but it feels nice and soft it doesn't feel like there's a ton of product in it or anything which is what you want now we're gonna go in with the monarch matte paste and I'm gonna show you guys something that is very very interesting when you emulsify this product as you can see it is sort of this light mint green almost white color it's really really nice smells very clean almost smells like Irish spring soap if you know what I mean by that it has a very clean, like soapy smell, which is good. You don't want your hair products to smell too, too strong. And I'm gonna get a decent amount of this, about that much, about the size of a giant glob of toothpaste. So wait till you see what this does when I emulsify it. So we're gonna break it up in my hands, warm up the product before going into my hair. Look at that! Oh my God. It is literally such a rich and creamy hair product. It's actually kind of crazy. The first time I did this, I was like, uh, what's happening? <laughs> All right, but anyway, we're gonna go into my hair just like this. Start at the back, because you don't want to get too much product in the front, because again, we already have that volume set into place. This is just giving our hair the final touch before walking out the door. are the final results. And this is the final 
final result, guys. This is what I created with the Monarch Matte Paste. It's a great hair product, and as you can see, it's not as matte as you would expect it to be. It is not as matte as some of these other matte products, and I love that because when a product is too matte, Sometimes it can have those stray flying hairs and it almost can make your hair look damaged if it looks too dry. So this is matte, but it has a slight bit of natural shine, which I love. It created a ton of texture in my hair. I did use quite a bit of it. I probably could have used a little bit less to be totally honest, but it's okay. In retrospect, when I go outside and hit the heat, this is gonna diffuse a little bit, it'll loosen up, and it'll look a little bit more natural. All right guys, so before we close out today's video, I wanna give a huge thank you and shout out to today's video's sponsor, Rose Gold and Black. Rose Gold and Black supports me as a creator, guys. They allow me to make content for you guys on a weekly basis, and I am so blessed to be able to do that. It would be awesome if you would click on the link in the description of this video, head over to rosegoldandblack.com, pick out some of your most favorite jewelry pieces, and if you click on that link, you'll get a discount on it as well. All right, guys, if you like the video, give it a big fat thumbs up down below. Drop your comments in the comment section. Let me know what videos you would like to see next, and I'll do my best to make those for you. If you have not already, hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you can see when I post a video next, and join the freaking crew. We are growing every single day, and it is all because of you guys. You guys rock. I'm out. I will see you next week. Peace.